Good morning, beautiful babes. Welcome into Sugar Fingers. I know it's not even morning. It's noonday. Hey, what can I say? I'm just going to go ahead and get ready. Today, I'm going to actually put on some makeup because I know that's a bit unusual for me here lately, considering I've been doing so much around this house no nails, which I'm glad because by now they would have been busted. All right. I've like totally messed up, but I still have some more chores to do today. So I'm not doing nails, but I am going to go ahead and beat this face. As you know, over there on behind the scenes, life with sweet Angel and Mike, the girl is doing some home updating, trying to get things cute for the holidays, or just trying to get things cute for us to look at. You know, sometimes you have to change it up a little bit. So that's what I do today. So let me go ahead and just get my teeth brush, face wash, hair fluffed out, and let's get dressed and uh, start this day. And put on some makeup. Let's, let's look cute. Let's look cute. Okay. And I showed y'all this on one of my shower routines over there on Beauty by Sweet Angel. But this is the Dr. Jacobs Naturals Castile Soap. It's the Shea Butter Castile Liquid Soap. And I have been washing my face with this. I really love this stuff. I mean, it's like I had a breakup or so right here, which probably was like, I don't know if it was uh, ingrown hair or something. But, you know, it gave me a little bit of a blemish right there. But this is really helping to dry that up and just deep cleanse my face. So that's what I'm using today. from this side is kind of crazy so we're gonna fix that that's I kind of like recording on this side you know change it up a little bit but daytime skincare is pretty simple right now I have just been using this a new vital it is a day lotion and it has an SPF of 25 in it so I like that And since I'm going to do a little bit of makeup, I'm also going to use this Avon and New Hydra Fusion Daily Beauty Defense. This has a broad spectrum SPF of 50 sunscreen in it. So I will put this down as a bit of a primer base. And I find that using those products with the SPF in them helps to lighten up any little dark spots that may be on my face as well. So that works perfectly. And now it's time for the hair. Hair products. Let me show you how I mix up my hair serum, I can call it. My hair serum. That's what it is. I just put it all in here and mix it up. So first, we're going to start off with my Cantu. Super thick, so I have to shake it down. And I do squeeze that into my little bottle here. Oops. No rhyme or reason as to how much, kind of, sort of, but, you know, I kind of know it because I be doing that stuff, you know, I be feeling it. All right, then I'm going to add in my Luster's S-Curl No Drip Curl Activator Moisturizer in here. And this is just so I don't have to pull out each individual product, you know, I can just do it like so. 
And then on Beauty by Sweet Angel, I've been talking about glycerin. I have some glycerin here in the bathroom as well. And I add more of this because this really gives my hair that silky texture. And I have to pop it in like so. Not a whole lot because glycerin is in the other products as well. And then I'm just going to do a few pumps of this from Avon, the Elastin Propylee Thera Hair Oil Serum to give my hair a little sheen. Just a few pumps of it. Let's that on that and then we'll just shake it up. Mix it, mix it, mix it. And I did show y'all how to mix up this hair cream here. This is shea butter and also my Cantu Shea Butter Curl Moisturizer. This just helps to help my hair kinda Define it a little bit more. So put a little bit of this on, rubbing it into my hands, pretty much dissolving it. That just kind of wakes it up. Also gets in that scalp. Yes. I keep my hair moisturized because I think that's really what helps keep it as healthy as it is even though I color treat my hair a lot yeah I do so now that I have that on I will pump out a few drops of this rub it in my hands and lightly stroke over it like so getting it down in the scalp One more. And once that's done, I take my soften free, grow healthy milk, protein, and olive oil foam wrap lotion. I'm not wrapping my hair, but pretty much this is kind of like a styling lotion for me to help lock everything in place and taper down any little spiky hairs I might have or make them spikier depends on what's up. And I basically don't even need to brush my hair but I've been trying to do that a little bit more because I don't know why it is when you have short natural little TWAs you don't really brush your hair a lot because I guess the styles doesn't it doesn't really call for it or something, but especially in trying to brush around my edges a little bit more to stimulate growth. But I think I'm just naturally thin sides. In fact, I have edges. I just don't have my temple area. So that's just me. Been that way since day one. And, you know, I use products that help to kind of fill it out some, but, you know, it's like a constant thing. You just have to keep it up. And you know how we all, we don't always do like we should do to maintain. And then I clean up around the edges, making sure there's no product like licking or all of my ears. Make it cute girls, make it cute. And I'll put a little lip balm on. Mm -hmm. Keep the lips moist until I get to the lipstick. Let's get cute. Okay. After a little bit of a journey, I went ahead and um, sat my butt down. Let's get this makeup done today. So, y'all, just probably touching on some things I haven't touched on in a while. And that's my Fenty Beauty. I'm back to it again. So, I'm going to prime my face. Everything that I'll be using is going to be across the screen and in the description box. And, um... You know, I can't do a makeup tutorial because I don't know what I'm doing. I just do me. That's it. So when you do you, 
it's all good <laughs> absolutely it is foundation i'm going to be using my tarte amazonian clay the 16 hour full coverage that's a long time isn't it though yes y'all i've been busy working on this house taking one room at a time for the most part you know how we have to just kind of get your thoughts together as far as what you want to do decor so that's really the only way i know how to do it one room at a time pop this on here surely is normally i start with my brows but today i am doing things a little different why i don't know why probably because i haven't done my makeup in a while and i just didn't remember that that's why i did it <laughs> how about that how about that oh i need some brow pencils oh my goodness these are the rimmel um Rimmel London brow pencils and I like them most of all to me they stay on and I'm going to use my Fenty concealer what is this in 260 Wow, it's funny how you take a few days off of doing your makeup and you come back with a whole new brow game. How about that? Let me go wet this big hokey dokey spawn. Okay, then. Y'all know my El Cheap O L A Colors Press Powder. This one is a nude. I use it to set my lid. Mm -hmm. Dollar Tree Girl. Now for eyeshadow. I do have out my little Fenty Beauty little Snap It palettes, but you know, the colors I picked out are not really all my favorites, but I'm going to try this palette, these shades right here, and see what I can come up with. I don't know. I really don't know. I'm kind of feeling like the burgundy brownish kind of thing right now, so let's go into that. Hmm. Put this on the lid here. And into this one, I am going to use this to blend out the edge here. I think that's all I'm going to do with that. Yes. And now I'm going to take my Glimmer Sticks Avon Eyeliner in Cosmic Brown and line my bottom, line my lower lash line, and also not really wing it but do my top my top lash line as well so we'll see how that goes okay that's good we're not doing lashes today we're just going to put on some of my falsies maybelline falsies mascara waterproof of course because y'all know i have the crying his eyes around it's gonna lift my lid up so i can get to these little lashes i have more than i used to because of the wonders of jamaican black castor oil but not nearly as long as some people's q-tip to fix my little boo-boo right here i messed up oh uh -huh. yeah All right, just a little bit on the bottom lash as well. All right, we're going to put a little bit more definition back to the face. Going to use some of this Fenty uh, Shady Biz. Yeah, yeah. Let's see what we can do with her. Dig off in there real good. Tap, 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 tap. Mm -hmm. And the nose. And actually, for my highlighter, a fan favorite, like my favorite, is the Wet n Wild Mega Glow Highlighting Powder. This one is in Precious Petals. I love this one, always. I'm just going to do my nose with it, though. Mm. 
-hmm. and maybe maybe just a little bit I can't help myself and now I'm ready for the lips y'all know fashion fair is back yeah and I wanted to use this pressed powder I'm not sure if they still have this particular shade or not but it's in chestnut the press powder um, of course the packaging of theirs has changed but hey it is what it is let's just put a little bit on it just to honor fashion fair on the scene again soften that highlighter up right there on the edge yeah and how about some fashion fair lipstick this one is rampage we're just going to take it like so and then we're going to take some fenty lip gloss gloss and sweet mouth mm -hmm. and let it do like that that's it that's all we're doing I think that's all we're doing. <laughs> Fenty and spanked. Lipstick and spanked. She finished. She's done. And that's it, beautiful babes. Just wanted to hang out with y'all for a brief moment over here on Sugar Fingers. That ain't looking Sugar Fingers right now, but that's okay. Because you know what? <laughs> she cute anyway. I'm just playing. She is going to put on some earrings. It's been a minute. I know. This is a fun day. It's Wednesday's hump day. We're going to make shit happen today as always. Yes, indeed. Nothing can stop a train. Can't stop a train. We're going to make it happen. Y'all, this lotion, I'm so in love with it. The Jurgens oil infused enriching shea butter lotion yes it smells so good i love it oh it is and that's what's really been saving my hands these several days since i've been working behind the scenes on my walls and painting and all of that junk Oh, honey, this lotion has saved my hands. For real. That's why, you know, I say take care of them, nourish them. You know, I'm going to deal with these nails when I finish doing all my work. But right now, the hands is what's given right now because I'm super excited about that. And let me tell you, my fragrance of the day is Prada Candy. Yeah. Put a little bit behind the ears, girl. Mm -hmm. <laughs> on the wrist you know it's just a rollerball so you know it's just like you can only roll it so many places yeah so that's it we're getting ready to get busy because right now what do i have i have a shipment getting ready to get dropped off in just a few minutes i am how many stops away i am three stops away i got the rest of my caulking coming i'm gonna get that done today over there on behind the scenes if you know what i mean in the family room i put up a little wall <laughs> check it out over there check it out over there there's a fly in the house mike's outside working so he got the door open and this fly came in the house like trying to steal my joy trying to steal my shine a fly but anyway i'm out of here y'all thank you so much for coming to hang out with me on sugar fingers please like comment subscribe and always keep the hair the face the hands and the feet looking gorgeous see you on the next one mm -hmm.